this is what uh, this is what we call a closed tube. So this is the open end, and there is a stopper here which acts as the closed end. And we can vary the length of the tube, meaning we can vary the distance from the open end to the closed end by um, drawing this thing um, in and out of the tube. Right, and there's even a scale here so that you know what is the length of your tube. All right, okay, we are going to position a speaker just outside the tube. This speaker is connected to a signal generator, so we can uh, adjust, we can choose the frequency of the monotone that's being emitted by this speaker. Um, let me choose something like 800 hertz so what you are hearing is the 800 hertz uh, sound wave produced by the speaker now a fraction of this sound wave is going to find its way into the tube let me lower the volume first yeah so when the sound wave uh, reaches the closed end what is it going to do it's going to reflect right and when the sound wave arrives at the open end guess what it's going to reflect again. It's going to go back into the tube. Right? It, it, it may be rather surprising why a sound wave will reflect when it arrives at the open end. But that's another story, all right? So for now, just, just, uh, just believe what I say, right? The sound wave, when it arrives at the open end, is going to reflect back. And when it reaches the closed end, it's going to reflect back again. So we have all these incident and reflected waves uh, traveling between the, the, this length of the tube. All right, I'm going to vary the length of the tube and listen, all right? Do you hear um, fluctuations in the loudness? So for example, um, let me find a loud. Huh? Yeah, this is a loud. This is a soft. Loud soft loud soft so what's happening 